world. How's Alvin? Dandelion, do you always have to butt your nose into? Just asking. Something troubling you? She's just... Uh, I don't know anymore. Let's go. Can't talk about women on an empty stomach. But... No buts. Zoltan and I agreed to have a drink today. A mercenary dwarf and a wandering troubadour who knows all the loose women in town. I couldn't choose better advisors. Let's go. Hey, Zoltan. Greetings, Dandelion. Get out. Our monster slayer looks bitter. Something happened? Nothing you need to know. Geralt is experiencing cognitive dissonance, a rather unpleasant tension that accompanies the appearance of two conflicting cognitions, be they thoughts or judgments. You're so full of shit, Dandelion. Simply put, he cannot decide. I assume the dissonance relates it. My dissonance is nothing to you. That's where you're wrong, Geralt. We're your only friends, and friends help each other. You'll see. We'll have a drink, and you'll know exactly what to do about Shawnee. Somehow I don't think so. Ooh, the vodka's nicely chilled. Gentlemen, cheers! Damn all dissonances! Ooh, delicious. Nothing like a good belt of liquor. Yeah, not bad. Incidentally, Zoltan, why are we drinking from tankards? I swear I saw glass in here. Serious problems require serious solutions. Half measures get you nowhere. I get it. Half measures for Dandelion, though. He yammers enough as it is. Will you stop whimpering like a spoiled lass and spit it out? Shani is wonderful. But? But I'm a witcher. Killing monsters is my destiny. Don't bullshit me about destiny, Geralt. I realized long ago that all those pathetic bits by Etlina and the like are the same crap and humbug as those dissonances. You may be right, but honestly, do you see me as a cobbler or a farmer? Mm, no. I guess I see your point. Damn it, I don't get it. What's one got to do with the other? No one said you'd have to stop slaying monsters, right? She didn't say either way. Let me explain, Dandelion. Just because a woman doesn't say it, doesn't mean she doesn't want it. In fact, they often say they want something when they really want the opposite. I'll drink to that. Oof. Strong enough to make you cry. I'll tell you what's up with dames. You can theorize all you want, but you'll never figure out what's going on inside their heads. There's just no understanding women. Highly original, Dandelion. Sneer away, but you won't put me off. The problem is you don't know what you want. And you don't know what you're talking about. I've never had a family, but I am a poet. I know something about people. Tell me this. Do you want a family or not? Oh, Dandelion, it's not that simple. Answer the question. You know what I mean. If it weren't for this mess, Scoia'tael, the Order, Salamandra... If you only knew how much, Dandelion. Right. The family is the fundamental unit of society. <laughs> eh, screw it all. I've got the hiccups. That's not exactly what I was thinking of. I just want to settle down. I've heard that tone before. Let's have another drink. I can't throw these damn hiccups. I know. Let's go to a whorehouse. Make it your stag night. Dandelion, we were talking about relationships in case you didn't notice. Besides, they won't let me in. I'm a filthy non-human. Only the weight of your purse counts at the house of the night. Besides, the madam owes me a favor. Come on, Geralt. Live a little. Do they have dwarf women there? Sure they do. It's the best whorehouse in Tamaria. So, Geralt, you coming? Mm. I'm telling you, nothing like a trip to the whorehouse to get you thinking clearly. All right. 
Let's go. One for the road. Gerald, are you about to vomit? I never puke after vodka. Shh. There's a child in the house. Be quiet and go to bed. I need some air. <laughs> <laughs> 